Look at what my girl texted me. Do you see this nonsense? This is what I gotta deal with every day. She's so cute. I should have shaved today, but you know what? I'm a manly man. What's up, my quesadillas? Today is September 23rd, 1947. And yeah, it's uh, been a been chill day. I just been editing, you know, doing the do. I uploaded the share house tour video. Look at this. Spiders kill the real nasty bugs, so like, I don't even mind spiders. Spiders don't even look bad. They kind of look scary, but like, centipedes, cockroaches, freaking, like, caterpillars. I mean, you won't, you won't see caterpillars in the house, but like, mainly cockroaches. Like, cockroaches are nasty. Fuck that shit. But spiders are f*** with. My girl's calling me. Why are you calling me? You can't fall asleep. Well, calling me isn't gonna help. I could make you feel better. How? Oh, I'm not there. I can't give you a massage or anything. Just talking to you. Why do you want to talk to me? You're so mean. I love you. What time is it? 20. Just um, close your eyes and count sheep. No, that's not Well, talking to me is just gonna make you more awake. Can you stay on the phone while I'm trying to go back to sleep? Um, yeah, sure. No, oh, baby. You have to, it's okay. No, I want to. Are you sure? Yeah. Put the phone down. I'm gonna go to Jeffo's house, and then we're just gonna go, we're gonna play some Smash. Play the key. I don't want to think of anything. Mm. Why are you trying to talk to me? Just go to sleep. I can't, you'd be distracted. Okay, I'm gonna be 100% honest with you, Charlie. Don't be mad. What? This might affect our relationship in a negative way. What? I don't know if I want to tell you anymore. Tell me. You promise you won't be mad? What is it? You promise? What is it? You have to promise me you won't be mad. I can't tell you. Okay, I won't be mad. I hope we stay together after I tell you this. If we will. What? So the truth is, uh, lately it just hasn't been the same, and, and like I'm just not feeling that good because I've just been having really fat shits lately. Well, so I'm vlogging right now. That's what. <laughs> Why do you hate me so much? I just can't stay in the morning, and I can't fall asleep because I'm scared, and I pull that shit. What the hell? <laughs> I just have to tell you. I mean, what did you think I was gonna say? I don't know. I was thinking. I can't get mad. This is gonna affect our life. Hopefully we don't break up after one. What's her name, huh? Her name is Diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> that's an ugly ass fucking name. <laughs> I'm baby. Yeah, no, that's why I was like. 
Because you literally just called the right one else. <laughs> Recording. Hola. I'm just like starting this today's vlog. Wow. <laughs> yeah, wow. <laughs> Were you like barely starting? I mean, no, I was like barely starting. So it's okay. You can just start again. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not that. I'm just you're just taking up my time right now, and I'm just I want to get this done so I can go out and then do stuff. Dear Liam, did I watch you today? Did I watch you today? No, I don't think. No, no, you're not wasting my time. You're just like. Making Wait, so a little bit. Oh my gosh. I love you, babe, but you know, you know I'm a busy man. What the book? I called you one time, but you want to play Smash. <laughs> that was just like one time. But Shelly, I'm just a busy man. That's why I got you, cause I'm a busy man, and you know that. <laughs> how, does it, how does it tie into me? Cause you're like, ooh, Kaza, a man, a busy man. With responsibilities. Damn, I think I like him. Right? I can't, I can't just turn into a bum now that I have you. Now that I'm with you. I can't just be a nobody. I gotta stay the K that I was when you met me that day. But even if you turned into a bum or I'm gonna fucking uh -huh. leave you. Uh huh. See, that's why I love you, and that's why I chose you, and actually fell in love with you, cause I know, I know you're different. But still, <laughs> it's for myself. I got shit to do. Jeez. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta go play Smash. No, I'm not gonna play Smash. You're gonna go play Smash. No, I'm not. Literally, exactly what's gonna happen is when I put the phone no, down. No, no. Let me tell you what's gonna happen. What? You just said you were going to Jeff O's house to play Smash. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, you're right. You know what? Uh, you know what? Tucci. Okay. Um, well, when you watch this vlog, this is exactly what's going to happen. I'm going to say, love you. Good night. I'm gonna hang up, put the phone down, and be like, all right, anyway. <laughs> and then continue what I'll say. You're not gonna, you're not gonna touch your heart and be like, oh, she's so cute. I go for it. No. Wow, I can't believe you. <laughs> you already know I, I love I was you. gonna do that. You'll be like, oh, Oh, it's like a sleep. Oh. You know, no, I'm just gonna throw my phone up to hang up. What? No, don't do that. No, I'm not. <laughs> Look, baby, you know I love. You don't need it. Reassurance. You don't need it. Yeah, I do. I need it to live. Okay, oh, well, that's, <laughs> that's why I'm gonna say I love you at the end of the call. Oh, you're right, you're right. It's not like I just hang up on you without saying I love you. What if you're sitting in a restaurant and you're like, we gotta go, mate? I don't know. I, I don't know, but you're wasting my time right now. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Like, baby, you need to see. Um, um, you are so beautiful. Alright, anyway, where was I? There was also some comments talking about my walls. This is not mold, guys. It's a bunch of holes in the walls. Cracks and stuff like that. Like, look at this. It's like this. 
Honestly, it kind of gives me tripophobia. That's what it's called, right? The fear of holes. Hey, y'all like that transition? I know that was pretty lit. Taking my vlogs to the next level. I'm a professional vlogger, so I gotta be doing professional vlog tricks. Honestly, I haven't done vlog tricks in a while. I need to get some practice in. Hold up. Bop, 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 bop. I'm gonna do a 360 camera tray flip. Yeah, I'm a little sloppy. I need to work on it. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. We are in fact in Shinjuku. Haven't been here in a fat minute. So I was supposed to go over to Jeffo's house and play some Smash with all the boys. But Jeffo's actually out with the girl now. And so yeah, I'm meeting up with Michael and Sora. They're at the batting cages just smacking some balls right now. I personally hate baseball. I like the theme of it. The baseball song like doo 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 doo. I forgot. You know what I'm talking about, right? Like the baseball song. Going to a baseball game, that would be fun. It's like a pretty American thing, I feel like. And you know, I'm, I'm American, so I, I f*** with it. And I also feel like it's a pretty Japanese thing too. Japanese people are good at it. It's an American and Japanese thing. So, you know, I f*** with baseball kind of on a overall level, but I just don't f*** with the sport. First of all, it's boring. It doesn't keep going, you know, like soccer or something like that. It's slow. It's like one play and then they stop for 30 seconds another play and then they stop and then they another play and then they stop and i know other sports are like that too but like baseball is just extra boring like you can't even see the ball and it's just like there's not many outcomes of what could happen i feel like in baseball there's some cool shit that can happen but like i don't know it's just not that exciting to me and then in the second part why i don't like baseball is because it just seems so dangerous you're literally just throwing a rock around basically and it's just waiting for someone to get knock their teeth out knock someone's eye out make a dude unable to have kids i know technically other sports have more injuries like football you know but i honestly prefer to like break a bone or something or like tear something doing football than just get hit by a f rock you know what i'm saying it's scary because you always see it coming you always see the ball just moving fast with football it's just like you're playing you're having fun just roughhousing until someone breaks a leg or some shit and it's like ah oh, but like you don't it's not like you're throwing a metal rock around and it's like you're just, it's just waiting for someone to get hurt, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, maybe it's just a personal thing. My brother played baseball. I played baseball a little bit too, but my brother played longer than me and he was actually pretty good. He played up until he was like 13, 14. He could have got serious and would have been good, but he was also really good at swimming. So he just continued doing that as he, as he grew up and stopped baseball. But when he was like 13, he threw an all strike game. I forgot, what is it called? Like a no hit game or something like that. When he's a pitcher and he striked out every single person, the whole entire game. Like no one got a hit in the game. But yeah, my brother did that though. It's kind of crazy. Not that think about it, I don't know why he quit because he's American and Japanese that's like two good genetics for baseball I feel like but anyway I'm just bragging about my brother he's a badass but yeah no like when I was like seven I just remember my brother coming home early from a baseball game a bunch of blood just coming down his mouth he was getting help from my dad and like the coach and stuff like that basically he was in the outfield was about to catch a ball but I guess he just missed I don't know I guess he was just the glove was just not where it was supposed to be and the ball just went past him and just knocked his two front teeth out right here and it was just yeah he just straight up just lost two front teeth right there boom crazy sh luckily that didn't happen with his adult teeth that would have sucked so yeah i just don't really like baseball hey what's up boys all right we were just at a call right now we we're talking about how weird shinjuku is now you gotta check out amy hold up yeah, what you gotta, amy? You gotta look at amy okay okay she's got a gut but uh yeah shinjuku is weird it's more like it's just more raunchy. There's just a bunch of sketchy sh Oh, this bitch. This is Amy. Hello, Amy. Okay. Alright, yeah, no, but there's more like stuff here. A lot more 
definitely more Yakuza. They probably own half of these businesses. This is actually Michael's first time here. He's been here for like a year now, and this is his first time in Shinjuku. That's the reason why we're here, actually. But um, sad news. This is actually Michael's last night in Japan. He's leaving tomorrow, so we're spending our last night together. And also, Sexy Jeffo and Vujie actually leave the next day, too, so pretty sad everyone's leaving it's just gonna be us soon man yeah, basically Sam, how do you feel about leaving michael i'm gonna miss a lot of things here man mm -hmm. but i'm excited to go back hey all right here look this is why i don't want to play this is my fear of the baseball okay i swing a little bit too early and the ball hits the baseball at the right perfect angle where i'm like right here and it hits like boom bah, right in my eye that's what i'm scared of that's why i don't want to do this Right? That's a possibility. That could happen. Exactly. You know what? I also got a fear of baseball. Like one time, like when I was a little kid, we were playing like baseball, like we are hitting a big ball, like a bouncy ball. Like you play what ball with it? I was hitting that with the baseball, and I hit it, and it just boing, and it hit back into my <laughs> temple right here. And I knocked myself out. Yeah, when I was like 8 or like 10 or something. Yeah, I could have died. That's a temple. You could kill someone. You see them in the temple. I learned that in Taekwondo. That could have killed me. Ever since then, no more baseball for me. Can't dress like this. Put a bag on the beach. Put a bag on the leak. All right, we're about to hit up this izakaya right here. Since it's Michael's last night, we got to do some traditional Japanese things. So we're going down to the first izakaya I went to in Japan. This is where we went in the It's Lit in Shinjuku vlog. This was a long ass time ago, like last year. Brings back memories. They just gave us some eggs. I know you can read. That's what you train for. Wait, actually, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I go that way to the K.O. line. I'll see you later. Yes. Hit each other up tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Uh, peace out, boys. What's up big boys? Alright, I might look a little bummy today. I got the same clothes on from yesterday. Cause usually what I do is wake up, go on a run, work out, stretch, and then I'll head over to Matsuya and get the morning set. Cause the morning set is a good amount of food. Rice, egg, meat, miso soup, some vegetables. And it's only for 300 yen. And after that I take a shower. But yeah, I basically got to do everything, but I didn't have enough time to take a shower. I woke up a little late today cause I got home late. But I gotta go to Shinokubo now to meet up with the boys. So I don't got time to take a shower. So I'm dirty anyway so i'm gonna just wear my dirty clothes actually you know what i'm gonna be 100 real with y'all do you guys ever just wear your dirty clothes just because it you know maybe that's a good piece of clothing or like just because you don't want to wear new clothes i don't know you just look at it and it's like it looks clean i guess actually though i don't have a whole lot of clothes so maybe that's why i do that and like if you switch your clothes all the time it's just more laundry you know i'm being economical here you guys don't do that with at least pants come on now changing underwear and socks i understand that that feels kind of filthy you know like keeping your underwear and socks sure maybe be, but like definitely pants come on y'all gotta be reusing your pants maybe even three times i probably do it three or four times i'm sure i've done it like four or five times they just don't get dirty or they don't look dirty at least i don't know maybe i'm like um dirty we're in shinokubo now this is the korea town of japan about to eat some sushi apparently this is a really good sushi spot that's where to go it's the best sushi i've had when i go to kaiten sushi i always just get maguro wait you know what's weird though why is tuna in japan red but like in america it's like tuna like white and stuff why does it turn like white and stuff? like gray or whatever that's when it's cooked right i think no yeah yeah so maguro when you cut open it to any type of tuna it's always red meat oh yeah and then yeah. when it's cooked it turns into that right yeah if you cut into the belly, mm -hmm. like there's like some parts that are white, mm -hmm. and that's like considered like old toilet, which is more expensive. Old what? Old toilet. Old toilet. Sor is a fisherman, so he knows this shit. Don't you sport fish? Yeah. <laughs> Catch and release, man. Well, this is officially our last time we'll ever see Michael ever again. Going back to Australia, Perth. Going back to the down under. Yeah, back down, down under. under, back to the outback. Gonna go eat kangaroo meat. Gonna eat some ripa macas. And he's gonna have a good time. His flight is at 8 today. He's in a couple hours. What is your best memory in here in Japan? Oh man. Oh, you gotta hit me like that, dude. <laughs> this is a, no, this is a hard one. Nah. I swear to God, it's just all the times with you two. This is you two, yeah. Mm -hmm. You two are there, it's a good time, you know. Mm -hmm. The barbie, the barbecue. Oh, no, nah, no, nah, the barbecue, yeah. Probably the barbecue, right? Yeah, that, yeah, was good. Yeah. that was good. 
the snap. Or just the general all nighters, I don't know. Mm -hmm. We had a bunch of all nighters. Yeah, yeah. Shoot, yeah. Michael's going back to um, Australia to go to college. So I'm going to college in like 2021. So coming back next year, well, fucking in three months to study Japanese again. Then the year after that, going to college. Oh, yeah, yeah. So you're going to be back in three months for yeah, another yeah. year? Not for another year, maybe like six months. We'll see. Oh, what the f Yeah, yeah. So, see you soon. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah. Okay, it's okay. like, I'm gonna dip out real quick. I'll be back in like three months. Alright. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was about to cry over this. I yeah, thought yeah. we were never gonna see each other again. <laughs> nah, nah, go ahead, man. This is pointless then. We're <laughs> chilling. <laughs> we'll see you later. Alright. We'll be back soon. Turning up. Using brain cells like always. Yeah, yeah. We'll yes, sir. Oh, I'm the other way. Damn, I go. Fuck, man. We gotta stay in touch, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, man. You gotta, I'll keep on that group chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah actually. I keep sending us videos and shit of what the fuck yeah, you're yeah, doing, yeah. man. We're trying to see this shit. It's a nice time. Yeah, yeah. Bye, Michael. I know, man. Oh, I'm oh, oh, serious, man. Yeah, when they hit me at the sushi place, oh, I was like, what's up? I was about to tear it off. This was part of us, man. This is all man. one thing. Yeah, yeah, wait till he's back. Me, Max, Michael, must have been so much of a Gotta keep this shit strong, okay? Yeah, you know what though? At least now, out of other ones, like we're the ones that are like doing kind of the same thing. So now I can like really narrow our focus down to what we're trying to do. I mean, yeah. I guess the show was getting tiring. Like all the all nighters and shit. Yeah, all the partying and stuff. It can't just keep going. Yeah. We can obviously do it. Yeah, but yeah, we gotta focus on our shit. Yeah. Get this TSA shit done. I feel like I'm gonna be doing a bunch of more podcasts as well now. I was thinking, literally, like when Michael leaves, just straight grind. It really will be. It's like we're just trying to have fun, you know. I mean, I lost the, the time before Michael leaves, but now he can really. To like before, like when we like hermit ourselves because like we're just like, you know, I guess pretty lonely. Yeah, that's not good for us. It's gonna happen again like that, you know? So we gotta like kind of like, we gotta keep ourselves like going out there and being social and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotta stay out there. You gotta do big, better. Yeah. Yeah, actually, like try some different spots. Like, Go travel. Yeah, explore. We should definitely travel to like Osaka or some shit. Like Osaka, like Hiroshima. We I could do like more special videos like I don't know maybe some shit with like the atomic bombing and stuff like that yeah like do some like I don't know like some more shit about that type yeah, things yeah. Like, maybe like maybe where we like volunteer or some shit or like jump out or something else. yeah I'm down my mom was already talking to me about like volunteering and stuff cause like there's a lot of volunteer work that could be done out here there's two NAMIs and like you know houses being destroyed and stuff like that so like I don't have a job or anything I'm just using Japan for its content but I'm not I'm just taking from it I'm not giving anything back so I mean I guess that'll be nice you know yeah volunteering it feels like an end of an era the first year in Japan it was like the party year like getting used to it getting into it and like just seeing everyone yeah. family march Doors on the right side I feel like this, this is like, this is it, like this is, the this is like, and the like honestly, like, like it was kind of like a new chapter when we came back to Japan, but now is when that really starts, Yeah. and it really ended like with Michael leaving, it really but the last chapter ending, so now it's like, because Max left and it was already a little different, but we had Michael, but now it's just... Now this is like before the Max era. This is back to the beginning, back to the start when it was just you and me, man. For sure. I feel like we'll meet a bunch of people though. We'll meet people on the way. Let's do bigger and better things. I'll always be doing vlogs, but like we can do some more. We should try going up north or like down south. We should travel, dude. Let's travel. We should go to like the mountains and stuff. Have you ever climbed a mountain? Climb a mountain here. Like Mount Taco. Yeah. And like do 
things like that. I guess yeah, like go to like Osaka and like do the Osaka. We can make some bigger videos like I don't know, like a type of video where we do something specific for the history. Yeah. 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 TSA's. TSA's. <laughs> Alright, get in boys, get in boys. I'm gonna shoot too. Let's get it on this. Let's get it on this, boys. Dang shits. Alright. That's good seeing you. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, he's. Alright. Alright, peace. Good shit. Later, boo. Alright. Alright, alright. Good stuff. Charge my liquids by our rest. Alright, peace.